this right here is the stuff. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcoe, a new direction of a modern man. In today's video, I'm sharing with you guys my beard oh. butter secret. So this is something I do apply to my beard on a nightly basis. And this is something I do keep very secret. So don't really tell anyone, all right? So further ado, let's get right into the video. So if you guys are a new subscriber, if you guys are old subscriber, make sure you subscribe down to the channel down below and also hit the notification button so you get the latest content and updates on my channel. Like I promised guys, we are focusing on beard butter. So a little background of why I use beard butter. So when I was a kid, my mom always had natural products in the house and we never really went towards chemical products when it comes to now to anything to do with our skin or health or even our eating habits. And when it came down to our hair and just growth of the body or this, when it came down to hygiene, it was always natural based products. So when it comes down to this, I'm sharing with you guys something that I do use on a daily basis and so don't tell anyone about this because I want to keep it a secret but you can use it into your own beard process you can even use it to the top of your hair as well just for regrowth and just to have that long term longevity of your hair and make sure it doesn't brittle, get to make sure it doesn't break down or get brittle so what I do use is shea butter so shea butter is a natural product that I do use in my beard and it works wonders I have had and I still have to this day luxurious healthy skin through using shea butter so I do use it quite often I do use it from a process of my day-to-day -day in and outs and so I'm gonna show you guys how I apply this into my beard and how much I do use because it does get to that sticky stage where you use too little too much and it just kind of overdoes it. So further ado, let me show you the process of this. I'm also gonna show you the process to my beard secret, so stay tuned for that. So what we're looking at right here is by Mokumba. This is a yellow chunk shea butter. It actually comes in two different tones. It comes in white, it also comes in yellow. I think the white is just the dehydrated version. You can actually get a hard texture where it's actually kind of harder to break down in your hand. This is actually more of a creamier version. It's not too thick. It, it still takes time to moisturize into your hand and actually break down. So if I just show you what it's like inside, that's what it looks like inside right there. So when it comes down to the shea butter, it is thick. This is something I don't apply on my day-to-day -day basis. I used to do it in the mornings, but I tend to do this at night before I go to bed, after I give my beard a nice wash. If you're looking at how to wash your beard effectively, it should be a thumbnail, something right up there or something. So I'm gonna show you what I do regarding this. So I put like a dime size in my hand like I did before. So I'm gonna put it all in my hand and just rub it all around, like so. Now my hands are all oily with the shea butter. So from here on out, what I'm gonna do, I'm still gonna put it in my beard and rub down. Yet again, like I said, it is very thick. It is a thick substance, but you really wanna make sure it's in the beard. See, what you wanna do is just rub it around. Don't pull, your, don't pull on your hair too much. Let's make sure it's in there. Most importantly, make sure you get it under your chin because that's where you get the, predominantly the driest. And make sure it stay hydrated by putting a lot more underneath the beard. But after I put the shea butter in my beard, I basically just did a little small rotations within the beard, up and down, side up, up and down, left and right. So I just made sure that it's all in the beard and it feels good. And just to make sure that all my beard hair does get touched by the shea butter. And now I'm just gonna lightly just train my beard to grow downwards like I normally do. So what I do at the final stage is I kind of do something like this. You can also get your brush. And just lightly, just brush down, just lightly. So now at the final stage is when I do pick it out. At this, at this point in time, it is completely done. So what I did beforehand, just to let you guys know, I did let it set in my beard for a little bit. I just let it a little bit of moisturize. So I basically just rubbed it in, massaged the shea butter in my beard, and I basically let it set for maybe two to three, four minutes. Two to three, four, <laughs> just so it gets into my beard and just so it gets all warm and, and uh, moisturized in there. So after that is when I get my pick and I do pick it out from here. 
So when it does come down to this pick, I do take it lightly when it does come down to picking out the beard. I try not to pick it out all the way to the end because that's the way, that's the quickest way to actually break um, your hairs on your beard. So what I do, I put it through my beard and I lightly just push out and I do that. Push, put it in, push out as much as possible. Push out, there you go. And I do finish it off by just brushing it through and then pushing it, pushing it out. So it has a nice flow at the end. Get your final brush just to brush it down, brush the roots down so it has that nice trained beard. And you could use a fine comb if you do want to be all fancy. The great thing about shea butter it is a natural source, natural ingredients from the mother nature. So one thing I do apply when it comes down to shea butter, I do put on the top of my head. I do put on the healing processes of my tattoos. I do make sure I put it into my nails, I put it into my eyebrows, my eyelashes. This is something that will actually help you grow your beard, sorry, your hair a lot more faster and not only your beard, but your whole body. So this is something that I used since I was a kid and it's something that you guys probably uh, feel beneficial in your life if you do or are interested in trying something for more of a natural base product. So that is my process guys. When it does come down to my beard butter, this is my little secret. This is my little thing I do here. This is my process. So I hope you guys enjoyed that process. If you guys have any comments, put it in the comment section down below. And the question of the day guys is, what is your secret when it comes down to your beard grooming or your hair grooming. What is that one secret you do use? Make sure you put it in the comment section down below and subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell for more daily update content on this Arcway channel. My name is Mr. Lou and I'll see you guys in the next video.